A year and four months ago was the day my life changed. I was on my lunch break eating with my family and my Nina had suddenly showed up trembling and I knew in my heart that something was wrong. She then said, it's your dad and I knew that my dad had passed away and I remember holding onto my sister's arms and repeating the words no. Of course, the entire time and even days now, I am still in disbelief. There's an immense amount of trauma, not only that I endured, but my family. And I can only imagine the pain that others go through during this time. I dropped over 20 pounds in the following month. I had nightmares thinking of the death of my father. And then I found it difficult to focus and relate to others with sympathy. And I didn't understand why until later on. It breaks my heart to this day knowing a father who had passed away, as I can relate. It reminds me of the pain that I endured. I think of his family, his child, growing up without a father, and the hardships that it will bring, missing out on family functions, and the same burden that they will feel like the one left in my chest. Soon after, I felt the need to push myself and be strong for my family as well, which I did. I graduated high school and started my college studies a whole year early. I continued to work my full-time job and began a business of my own and I became involved in a lot of community work. A couple months later, I decided to attend a grief talk, seeking to find hope with my emotional heartache. And I did. I learned that all the activities I was involved in, exhausting myself, was only to fill the void of losing my dad and learned that it will be okay. And I'm here to shed light on grief and help others enduring any kind of pain and let them know that you will find happiness again. I want to break the perception of grief and the forms it comes in. Grief is everywhere and it's not limited to death. Some types are bullying, divorce, suicide, teen pregnancy, and pet loss. We are here to give grief a voice. Grief is a conflicting feelings caused by the end of or change in a familiar pattern of behavior. Grief is a natural reaction to any kind of loss. When enduring any types of these hardships, we experience a whole world of trials, like difficulty to concentrate, loss of memory, fighting, self-inflicting pain, and domestic violence. I am here to break the myths of grief and bring the awareness it needs, and let others know that it's okay to talk about it and get the help you need, just as I did. We are a work in progress.